Welcome to the Digital Maddie Show with your host and host Digital Mithun, your digital coach who is on a mission to help entrepreneurs build their digital empire with my self-made entrepreneur program. This show is all about unlocking the world of entrepreneurship, personal branding, content creation and digital marketing. I also bring entrepreneurs and experts on this show and extract their secrets of success which gives you a perfect road map for building your digital empire. With the beginning of the season 2 of this particular talk show, I have an amazing guest also called as a little wonder, also known as the dream catcher catalyst. She is already into the studio. Let's welcome her. You are listening to the Digital Maddy Show with Digital Mithil. So we have in our studio the little wonder. Let me introduce her. She is Arista Sahai from Bangalore. She is also known as the Dream Catcher Catalyst. She is a podcaster, a blogger, a motivational speaker, a young digital entrepreneur, graphic designer. and a public speaking coach so welcome arista to the season 2 of the digital maddy show so arista can you share uh, you know a bit about yourself your journey as a content creator so hello everyone i am arista sahai and thank you so much for having me sir uh, my uh, my journey as a content creator but well, it all started when the corona wave came and all the things went digital lockdown was there everyone was locked in their homes well and i got bored <laughs> i seriously got bored and i wanted to utilize my time effectively and as all my physical classes had been stopped because i am a bharatanatyam dancer and a karate kid and so everything was stopped and i couldn't find ways to entertain myself and my mom was an hr professional as well as a motivation speaker so when this corona wave came her motivational trainings that she used to take uh, uh, had to be stopped uh, because of the lockdown so when she shifted from physical to online she needed some help and one day she just came, uh, told me arista would you like to do video editing It's like sounds cool, mom. I would like to try. And slowly, I started editing, editing my mom's YouTube videos. Then I started uploading them, and then it just gradually went on. Learning more new platforms, learning new methods, learning new softwares, and yeah, that's my content journey. That's super cool. So Arista, as you said, that you know this journey. Like, anyways, you were into offline, lots of uh, extracurricular activities. You are into Bharatanatyam. You are also into karate. I think you are a brown belt, uh, if I'm not wrong, right? Yes. And you also do your uh, yoga, meditation. You all. I think you also practice guitar, and uh, you know you also are a very good artist when it comes to drawing. So, what was that moment, Arista? where you felt you know that you should start this creative journey very seriously well i always wanted to share my skills with the world well whether it be my painting skills or whether it be my motivation skills or my public speaking skills but the moment when i realized that i need to take this seriously was when my mom was in late uh, december 2020 My mom just approached me, and she was like, "Arista, you have been learning this since a long time now. It has been almost half a year, more than half a year. I think you should start your own very own podcast." I was like, "Ah, oh, mom, that's a great idea." And my mom approached me, and she told me that first you go to Anchor, you create your profile, you create a Gmail. I did all that. I did all of that, and now my podcast is being played on eleven different platforms. So that creative journey, she actually encouraged me. My inspiration, my motivation, my thing that keeps me going and wants me to grow more is my mom and my dad. They continuously support me on this journey, and I'm really thankful to them. Super awesome! Yeah. Super awesome! 
also you are an author so what uh, gave you the spark to write a book <laughs> again it was my parents well my parents uh, they wrote a book together uh, the secret sauce it is available on amazon as well as uh, different platforms and well i always loved reading books and that thing that connects with me, uh, like the feeling uh, i loved reading books and i'm a bibliophile i love reading books i c- love collecting them i've read i have a series called jeronimo stilton i have read those books a hundred times and i i just love books and when my mom told me that arista you're great at so many different things especially at public speaking why not write a book and also express your thoughts with the world i was saying hmm that's a good idea yeah then i slowly and steadily wrote a ebook uh it's called Spa- uh, speak up with sparkling confidence and it's all about public speaking so that was the story wow now this is this is super cool so uh, even a nice uh, heading like you know it's very catchy so uh, wish you all the best for you know you getting more success with this book and also continue to write a series of books uh, which changes a lot of people's life you know you you're, you're doing an amazing work so arista like you said that you know uh, december 2020 is where you came across the world of podcasting and your mother introduced to you know the podcasting so what was exactly uh, you know that gave you the boost that yes i should start with podcasting and uh, take the road ahead was there someone who helped you uh, or mentored you guide you and then how do you come up with a lot of topics throw some light on your podcast also well these uh, topics that i talk about is related to pursuing your dreams as my podcast is named wings to dreams i believe that some of the people just keep daydreaming or have dreams but don't go forward to actually pursue them and i wanted to help them and just slowly just started developing 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 i just start i just sat down one day thought about uh, what i was thinking when i was in that my mind zone when i wanted to pursue my dreams so i just sat down wrote down everything i knew and i just started speaking about them things that helped me things that motivated me things and the values which kept me going so that's how it came and the person who helped me helped me was my digital mentor digital mithun sir i was i was like really 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 thankful to you i actually my mother had started already started taking uh, help and guidance from you and i was i always came on visitor awareness days in our tribe and i was like sir is awesome sir is so amazing he i just i was like mom i also want to do something i also want to become like sir so and then she was saying yeah go into my teachable and uh, just log in into this course it was a video podcast mastery course that helped me launch my podcast it's like a really step by step guided process and i being a 13 year old could do it i couldn't believe it that i launched my very own podcast and it's all, i'm really grateful to you sir uh, and you got me through this journey through your courses and now i am really really thankful <laughs> most welcome yeah. most welcome i'm glad that uh, the course helped you and gave you a right road map to you know your mission that you have and you were able to launch uh, with your podcast so i'm deep deep gratitude for that arista for the shout out so arista uh, the mission that you have so how podcasting is helping you with your mission well i believe right now uh, people are mostly addicted not addicted uh, you could say they are mostly on their phones nowadays and kids like me are mo- mostly watching youtube videos or gaming and adults are mostly on social medias and i i actually didn't want to make videos i didn't want to show my face but then i realized there's something called podcast 
when only my audio goes and it inspires the world so i tried and thought of a way to more uh, express my thoughts and the best way i could come up with was podcasting and podcasting is now a growing medium and people nowadays uh, when moms cook in the kitchen or dad plays uh, like have some tea or when our grandparents have some tea or like the uh, nowadays people are just free they're just bored or you could say they are not productive so listening to a podcast gives you that productivity it gives you that nice feeling that okay yeah i'm doing something to improve myself i improve my knowledge about something whether it be it comedy whether it be some uh, what do you say horror movie ka a scene <laughs> and it, like you could podcasting is like various there are various podcasts on different topics so i found that yeah this is a good medium or a good type of platform for me to launch my thoughts and share it my thoughts with the world yeah awesome that's super cool so wings to dreams is the name of your podcast am i right yeah wow what a wonderful name so all the listeners if you really want to connect with your dreams and get the wings for it that's the right podcast to listen to so arista uh you said that you are a dream catcher catalyst all right so you also said that you are a budding entrepreneur so what's your road map as a budding entrepreneur so are you learning from somewhere what you're doing to take it to the next level well taking it to the next level i would definitely 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 hands down say that the sma program is helping me like the only thing that is like launching me taking me to the next next level is the sme program the self made entrepreneurs program by digital mithil sir i mean that program is like oh my god i every day look forward to it and i'm having the uh, like the urge to learn more about this digital world and how i can like literally take it to the next level and just make my podcast the next to- uh, podcast in the top 10 list mai kaise karu that will be done through the sme program it's just mind blowing <laughs> and yeah that's like the, that's the only thing that is going to take me to the next level and i truly believe that the sme program is a wonderfully crafted program and this is like literally mai kaise batau it's like most amazing program i've come across in days <laughs> thank you so much sir for launching the sme program and i'm really thankful to you for launching it super cool super cool and yes sme uh, took me some time it's my dream project so basically it's just uh, you know a 90 days uh, road map of how you can become an entrepreneur and launch it and uh, you know with you doing it consistently like you know the opportunity that you going to be the torch bearer uh, where the sme is also going to come with the uh, sme junior and you are going to take the lead of it as a budding entrepreneur so looking forward for that and uh, you know keeping my fingers crossed that yes uh, through that particular program you also get better platforms for it awesome so arista like you know uh, before we end this particular episode would you like to give any message to all the youth audience who are like you and want to have a mark uh, and create uh, you know a dent in the universe and uh, probably uh, create their own aura and magic around the digital world well i would like to say big things or big changes happen with small step and that like the first step you, you just need to take the first step then slowly things will build upon that's what i did i just took my first step i just went for it i thought about it and i just went for it i knew this was good and i knew this would make me flourish so i took the first step and uh, now i am constantly taking small small steps and constantly growing and most importantly pursue your dreams your dreams are going to take you to the next level your dreams are going to help you they 
see there are two types of dreams once you want to achieve and the ones you see at night both of these both of these are going to help you these are the true feelings in your heart that you want it's the purpose of your life what are you born for your ikigai and like this is uh, going to help you just take the first step and slowly go for it go for it just go for it yeah wonderful message arista from you know uh a little wonder like you that's really great to know that so arista all the people who want to uh, connect with you and listen to your podcast so how can they connect to it you can go on my instagram you can leave me a dm there and i'll surely get back to you you can also check my mini website on my landing page um which is in the link below and yeah you can connect me there all my social media platforms are listed that you can reach out to me through that awesome so all the people who are listening to this particular episode as a podcast or watching as a video all the links are available in the description do check out do connect with her on instagram and do listen to her podcast it's a dundil her podcast episodes are so amazing so thank you thank you so much arista for that so it was an honor to have you on our show uh, a 13 year old little wonder doing amazing things we just have 24 hours and in those 24 hours you are doing so many things so you are an example for so many people who think that life is so boring learn from arista sahai the life is not boring life is all about dreaming and then waking up and working towards make that dream come true so awesome arista I wish you all the best for your future ventures and your podcast super cool Thank you so much sir. Great. Thank you for having me and Most welcome. Thanks. Most welcome. Most welcome. Happy to have you. So you have just listened to the Digital Maddie show with your host Digital Mithil. Thank you so much for listening to our show and giving so much love. If you are watching this on YouTube, don't forget to subscribe to my channel and if you are listening on Apple Podcast or Spotify, don't forget to click the subscribe button. So this is Digital Mithil signing off at the moment until next time meet you soon with another guest and their exciting stories but until then keep rocking and stay safe